hello guys in this video i am talking about boshi 3 car charger also i will show you how to charge your car batteries with it i brought it from amazon for 3000 rupees if you interested in this product please check the description below i put the link on there you can buy through flipkart or amazon first let's say it's built quality It is dust proof and splash proof. It is 4 stage automatic battery charger including pulse charging and trickle charging. Its weight is about 460 gram and its AC and DC wire is about 1.5 meter long. Charge and maintain 6 or 12 volt battery. It is suitable for all type of lead acid batteries one button operation just press on just press the button it will senses the voltage and charge automatically in abnormal situation the charger switches to standby mode for example if loose contact or uh, poor connection the charger sends it and automatically stop charging does not allow the battery to be overcharged that means if you charge your motorcycle battery then you put correct mode motorcycle mode then it is safe and when the charge when the battery get fully charged uh, the charge charge will automatically cut off uh, go to ok position and charging will stop when it reach below 12.8 volt then it goes automatically automatically to trickle charging mode which is your batteries battery is safe and you can connect your battery uh, yes or how much you want no problem your battery is completely safe now let's talk its technology the battery charger is controlled by an internal mcu micro computer unit for intelligent monitoring and automatic charging at all times the chargers detect battery voltage automatically building automatic pulse and trickle charging mode this pulse charging and trickle charging is automatic we can choose manually if the 12 volt battery will drain below 10.5 volt then the charger detect and start charging in pulse it will help to remove little bit of sulfation and also uh, it will charge fast and if your battery is too old then the charger fail to detect 12 volt and it is start to charge in 6 volt mode which is very bad It has four mode, one six volt mode and three 12 volt mode. In six volt mode, battery capacity 1.2 to 14 h, and it will charge 7.2 volt at 0.8 amp. In 12 volt motorcycle mode, battery capacity 1.2 to 14 h, and the battery will charge 14.4 volt at 0.8 amp. In 12 volt car mode, battery capacity from 14 to 120 h, battery will charge 14.4 volt at 3.8 amp. In 12 volt AGM mode, battery capacity same from 14 to 120 h, and battery will charge 14.7 volt at 3.8 amp. But the voltage is not same. In 12 volt car mode, the battery will charge 14.4 volt. But in AGM mode, battery will charge 14.7 volt, which will overcharge if you select wrong. Okay, guys. Now let's talk its main features. It has smart amps technology. Utilize optimum charge current from 0.8 to 3.8 depending on battery's condition and charging stage providing fast high quality charges that ensure maximum battery life it has microcomputer unit 
that helps to restore sulfated discharge and acid stratified batteries to their original capacity without under or overcharging i will i will not say it work all batteries but i tested a five sulfated battery and three failed and two only passed Okay, now let's talk about its safety. Most advanced building safety features spark, short circuit, and reverse polarity protection ensure the safety of the operator and the health of the battery. Now let's see what will the charger do when it sends poor connection. Now the current is passing from the clamp through the tester which is rusted. Now let's see what will happen. The charger sends poor connection and charging stopped and ok. Late turn off. But the charger didn't turn off which is failed to detect poor connection. When the charger plug into AC, the blue light turn on. When the battery is charging, blue turn off and green turn off. Orange light blinks means battery not full and it is charged. If the OK light turn on means the battery is fully charged and it is goes to trickle charge when the battery discharge below 12.8 volt, which is maintenance mode. It also has a memory function which will help in power cut areas. I disconnected one clip from the battery and the charger stopped charging and when I connect it back in it started charging in same mode it also work if you unplug as you wire or the power goes when the power back the charger start to charge in same mode. Now I am going to disconnect charger as you wire and let's see it will charge in last charged last charging mode. Now I will show you how to charge car batteries. You don't want to disconnect the battery from the car. Just make sure your all car lights and accessories are off. If your door light is in auto, turn it in off position and if your car has key, remove it from the ignition switch. C3 is not supported to jump start your car or 
to power up any type of accessories in your car. You can also connect directly into the battery or if your battery is covered then check your vehicle usage manual or battery port. If your battery is EIGM or you are living in cold place then you can you can charge in fourth mode which is EIGM mode. My, in my case my battery is floated floated lead acid battery so I am charging in third mode car mode but if you charge floated lead acid battery in fourth mode then it will overcharge if you want to power your car accessory with car battery in charge then go for C7 also C7 has regeneration mode to repair lead acid battery C3 is only for maintaining battery it is not work well to repair battery I put C7 link below the description you can buy through there Okay guys thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe turn on the bell notification and if you like this video hit the like button also leave your comment